Good morning, everybody. It's another episode. Lisa's low down on love. And today, I am talking to you about busyness. Being busy and doing things that fill your day and make you happy. And it could be work, and it could be writing in a journal, it could be hanging out with friends, it could be checking out a new restaurant that you want to taste and sample. And just like packing your day, the gym, all the things that you have going on in your busy life. And uh, it's so important, so important, and this goes for guys and girls, that you create this really exciting, busy, busy life. Like, what do you like to do? Fill your life with things that you like to do. See, like, some people out there might like to paint, or write poetry, or, I don't know, do stuff, art with their hands, whatever. Um, some people like to do, like, home repair. I mean, whatever your deal is, put it in your life. Pack your life with these things, and here's why. So like when you're in a relationship, and the other person in the relationship, for whatever reason, can't hang out with you. They have something to do with work, or another obligation that takes them away. Or maybe they want to enjoy something that they like to do alone. You have to, be like, okay, awesome, love that. Catch up with you later, no problem. I have so many things that I can just redirect my attention to that it really doesn't matter. My happiness is not hinging upon whether or not this person can hang out with me and validate me and see me and be like, you're the best, oh my God, I'm with you all the time. Doesn't matter, it does not matter. If somebody wants to go and do something that makes them happy and you love them, then you're like, all right, bye. Do your thing. And sometimes people can get into like a little funk. And that's when they say to you, you know, I don't really want to be around you because you're like such an upbeat person and I'm in this funk and I'm only going to bring you down and blah, blah, blah. And they're all in their own twisty swirl. Bye. I don't want you around me when you're like that. If you need me and you want advice and you want to talk through your problems or talk through what you're thinking, I'm here for you. I love you and I'm here for you. But if you're making the decision to do it on your own and be like, I'll catch you when I'm back in my normal headspace again, do that too. You're all, bye, catch you later. Because why? Because I'm so busy. I'm so like jamming with my forward thinking, my future, what I want, what I'm doing. Doesn't mean I don't care about that other person, but it means that I care about me just a little bit more. See, I love you, baby, but I love me more. My day is full. So pack your day, be loving, be there for people, but not at the expense of you. Have a great day.